Hello and welcome back. Today we're going to be trying out some parkour over here on this server right here. You see, you see the play? There we go. See, now I don't have to say it. Woo. So I've heard uh, mixed reviews about their parkour on here. I've had some comments and some complaints. So I have gone through and I have played literally just the very first, like first run through to kind of get a feel for it. And I'm just going to jump around and you can kind of get my opinions on some of it as we go. We're just going to see what we can do. Now this is a nice little cindered four forks here. So I have run through this one once. And I can say that this bit here is the bit that a lot of people have issues with. This timed hang. And I kind of agree with it. To a sense that if your server relies on moving parts that your signal can affect like the grip of this, as you can see here, I am jumping like clearly into it and it's just not connecting. Like if your server relies on that for it to be a good parkour, to me that's that's not a good parkour because there's so many external factors that go into it. But like, so let me restart it here because like you get a few bad signals or it's busy and like it just doesn't work. You have to look at it at a specific angle as well. And as somebody who like really loves parkour and has done parkour many times on the channel, like it, it kind of frustrates me. Like it makes you feel like you're doing something wrong when you have pretty much no control. So again, as you can see there, like you're looking directly at it. Maybe there's something I'm missing here, but I know I'm not the only player who experiences it. Again, you jump straight into it. You're looking at it. It's still there and it doesn't grab on. Kind of frustrating to deal with. So we'll have a few more attempts at it and if not we'll take a bonus path instead we'll just go around a different way because at least that is something they have here but you should shouldn't need to rely on it and there's another section later on in this very map and again this is only the first map so like this is what people are playing when they're first introduced to your server and like that one there fair enough that was my jump like it hooks and sometimes it works perfectly like that and it flows and it's really nice but as somebody who loves parkour and like as a first experience to a server it's not necessarily the greatest look and i am sure by the amount of players on a lot of people would disagree with me and you know i'm not bashing it like i really enjoy playing it i just feel like there are jumps that you could make that are more complex and don't involve moving parts like that or like piston moving parts like at least there's a timing of rhythm to it so this one here i don't mind so much so like this one here it's nice you could do this much faster i'm just taking it slow i'm not really i'm not looking to set any land speed records here you know like that one it works and i've never had issues with the blocks that rope one on the few attempts i had going through it oh that's that one there was just me on the few attempts i had going through it was just I don't know, something about it, it just didn't seem to work very well. It sets like a really negative feeling in it. And if I wasn't somebody who really loved parkour and wanted to like really push on and just explore the rest of the maps, it would probably be a reason that I wouldn't play this specific style of server. Now, if you would agree with me or you feel like, you know, maybe I'm, I just seem bitter on that, then let me, let me know your opinions on it down below or give it a try for yourself and let me know kind of how you feel about it now I actually really love this like little glass pane section here I don't know why it's so simple but it makes me feel so good and so yeah so you've got the easy route here so we'll go ahead and we'll do this easy route first and this one here it's kind of all about the approach you kind of have to jump at an angle to get onto the chains. I don't know if you guys could see what I was doing there. If you jump straight forward, you just kind of flop for it. That was actually my personal best for that map, funny enough. What we'll do is we'll go back through, but we'll have a little look at this bonus path over here. This is something I haven't taken a little look at. Yeah, <clears throat> so what you do here is don't jump in the hole. This is one of those where patience and control is probably crucial to the actual yeah i don't know move those chains so like the chains yeah okay so i was just being oh god right um 
Do so you know how I said I absolutely hate maps where it's all relying on the blocks not disappearing on you? Well, that's that's really nice of them, isn't it? More of the disappearing blocks that I absolutely hate. Like, how... I don't know. Am I misunderstanding the enjoyment of blocks that disappear? Because, like, maybe I am. Do people enjoy this style of parkour? I, I feel like I must really be missing something here. I, d I don't know how... I understand how it works. But the timing just... It all seems so... It never quite seems the same. Everything always just seems a little off with it. Maybe I'm just old. Could be a case that I'm just old and this is the new style. Hmm. Okay, we got across. Sorry, I kind of had to just freeze there because that took way too much of my brain power to do that. That should not have taken me anywhere near as long. But it's just a, I don't know, just a horrible system, in my opinion. This time, this time, we're gonna land on that rope. We're gonna land on that rope. We're gonna climb the rope. Um, we're not gonna come back here, are we? That, that's what's gonna happen. <gasps> yes! Oh my god, that took seven and a half minutes to get across that goddamn platform. And like, that, the, truthfully, not the surface issue at all. That one, entirely me. That was entirely me. Now we gotta do this normal section here again. And then we have to come across and do this rope section here. And I'm hoping it goes a little smoother than the last time. Okay, okay, maybe I treat maybe I treated this rope section a little unfairly the, the first time round. Maybe a little. Why did I do that? Why would I do that? I'm starting to think, did I do these challenges to give myself high blood pressure? Like, it's just not enough already having high blood pressure. I think I just do these challenges to be like, my blood pressure is high. Oh, okay, I see. I see what I was meant to do. Yeah, that one there was just me being an idiot. No! Fool. You're a fool. It's okay, it's okay. I actually, these wraparound ones, as frustrating as they are, I actually really enjoy them. Because while they're frustrating, at least they're skill based, you know? It's just like, oh, you missed it? It's nothing to do with your connection. Can you? It's just like, uh, you didn't wrap around quick enough. Or you clip the edge and like that to me that's fair like oh i made a mistake cool 
Can you tell that I'm very frustrated with... Okay. <laughs> Wait. What am I supposed to do? I'm starting to think these bonus ones. They're just not... Not designed for me. Gotta remember, don't jump on the slime. Just let it bounce you naturally. Okay, here's the here's the idea, guys. Let's not do that course, <laughs> right? Let's go through and do the normal course, and then do the medium one instead of trying to do every single bonus one. Because I think in the time I've set myself today to kind of have a play around and get a feel for the server, I'm not going to get a true representation. I haven't played Minecraft fully in months, and I haven't played parkour properly since. I don't know, put the video up whenever my last video on parkour on here was, would be the last time I played parkour. That'll be, that'll be it. So, I don't think I'm giving them a fair judgement. I think I should play the normal map as intended, straight through, and not, not the bonus maps. And we already did the easy finish, so like we'll go and do the medium one and hope that it doesn't have more moving blocks that are out of our control. See, I quite like this little section here, too, where you can kind of just jump around them. That one? That one's on me. Sometimes I think I'm faster than I am still. And, you know, that's okay. Pepe's Challenge. I actually didn't read the name on this one the first time around because I was so focused on just trying to get through it. So I didn't even realise that there were people these were being attributed to. And again, like, I'm not taking anything against the creators of these maps. Because I know it plays dang hard to make a parkour map and to design them in a way that is fun, engaging, and frankly, addictive. Like, because even though that's like really annoying me, I sat there for a really long time, like you could see it, trying to do that, that bonus section because I wanted to give them the best possible, you know, possibility. Now we did the standard, so now let's go do the medium ending. Ah! Okay, so I guess I'm supposed to jump up on there. Oh god. This is crazy. What the hell? This is Oh my god, we got across, right. I was completely silent there because I just I just hit like hyper fixation. I just wanted to get across that to be honest. We're gonna go through for the full speed mode. Full speed? Not full speed, hard. We're gonna go to the hard ending and we'll see what that's like. Um, and we'll just give that a little go. And you never know, we might get better good enough at this first bit that we might want to go back for the easy ending at some point just to set a faster time. We're across, we're across. We're not just suddenly forgot how to do, like, part of the map. And yes, I know you can get up on top of these glass panes and do it, but also we've just seen how most of it went. So, like, is it worth it, you know? This is the hard ending.
See? It worked that time. I really want to finish this hard section before I move on to the next one. But also, I am conscious that it may take me too long and I have to, and I will have to move on. And that's also going to really annoy me. Because I don't want to spend half the video trying to complete one hard section. But also at the same time, I kind of want to spend half the video trying to complete this one hard section. Because I don't mind ladder parkour. I don't like... I'm not a great fan of slime parkour. But, you know, that's just a mechanical thing. Wait, is it the same? No, okay. It's just the start looks the same. Got it, got it, got it. Okay, okay, that wasn't so bad. So that one is disappearing blocks, but it wasn't so bad. Get up here, a little bit around here. This reminds me of a map from... Uh, Brain, the It's Jerry and Harry server? Or Harry and Jerry? That, that, that section there reminded me of one of the biomaps on it. That, but done correctly. Like that. Oh. Okay. That was a little difficult, that one. Are we supposed to go down? Uh, okay, we're supposed to go down inside the cube. Not on top of it, okay. What, 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 wait, 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 what the hell? Uh, huh? Ah, uh, huh? Okay, we're across. I I hated that. I I Hello turtle. Um That I absolutely hated, so we're discovering that I definitely have a hate for a certain style. I'm really hoping I'm not the only person who has a hate for that style, but if I am, I am. The Epic Creepers Challenge. Okay. What whatever happened to classic parkour maps? You know? Just a nice simple parkour for the old people like myself. <laughs> okay. We, are, we got across there. We got across there. Most of that was spent on that one section because my brain just was not comprehending it. But this is supposed to be the easy finish. Okay, it's ladders. Gotta, gotta love a bit of ladder parkour. I see. That, that, that is entirely me. That, that's on me. That's that's my bad, guys. That, that one's on me. Hmm. Okay. Can we not? Can we just not? Like, can we just work? Oh. Ugh. Okay, we're across, we're across. Now, I think, what we do, we're gonna do that one one more time. I think we go through that one one more time and then I'll give you my honest opinion on how I'm feeling about the server. And I'll let you guys decide by hitting the like button, whether or not you wanna see me do more on this server. Okay, I'm not happy with that start. Let's let's restart that one. One, one more, one, one more, one more time. Okay, okay. So like we'll do that and then i'll let you guys decide if i'm just being me right we're across that section we're across that section 
because there was a lot of bits in here that at the beginning I definitely did not understand, but now I do. And it seems unfair to like judge this map or this this section of maps because it's not one map, they're all created by different people. Based off of my experience there. So let's get across this. <clears throat> Boop, boop, launch me. Didn't quite launch me far enough. That's okay. Because now we know that, that right there is what we're aiming for. No! Ugh. See, it's a, it was a lot smoother the second time round. We also know we're aiming for the inside of these cubes this time round not the outside like so you know so that makes it easier right this here i really for the life of me do not understand the pattern on it like i feel like i'm just going crazy like it just i i i'm not seeing this pattern like there must be a pattern for people to get so fast at it but for me i i do not I don't, I'm not, I'm not seeing it. I, I mean, I've got across, I'm across, I'm not going to complain any more about that bit. I, I got across it, but there, there must be like, the way it rotates, there must be a certain pattern or time that other people will understand and see on that one. And I'm sure somebody will correct me in the comments on it and be like, it's because you didn't do X, Y, Z. And that's okay. It's a learning curve still for me. I've been out of the game for such a long time. Da -da -da -dun, da -da -da -dun. Over here? Bob? What was the ending on this one? Ladders, right? Like, the, the easy ending on this one was ladders. Okay. I want to sub three and a half minutes for this run on it. There, that, that I would be happy with right now. because it has been such a long time since I did it. I'm not going to get that, unfortunately. No, oh, no, I might, I might. Okay, I am, I am. Sub free, f sub free 10, okay. I'll, t I'll take that, a sub free 10. I'll take that all day. You know, it's not the greatest time in the world. Okay, Bear did it in 3.29. Okay, so it, it wasn't the greatest time, but it wasn't my slowest time either. So, in all honesty, guys, I'm going to currently give this server, as I stand right now, how I'm feeling about it. The parkour in it, like, a 7 out of 10. And that's probably higher than a lot of people are expecting me to give it. But I will say one thing. The map designs are very beautiful. I don't like the disappearing and reappearing blocks. I do think that servers can impact that and I don't think it adds much to the actual parkour but also I think the way they design it the way the medals work the way there's all these different options and they're never issues with respawns that I think is very great and I definitely think that with a bit more practice a bit more play and maybe a bit more understanding of it this server could easily like hit the parkour on 10 out of 10 so if you want to see me do some of the other maps go back through do the hard one on there and do the other bits and you just kind of want to see how that plays out then let me know in the comment section down below because i only do these videos if you enjoy them so be sure to like subscribe and until next time see ya